Hey everyone, it's OG Tech here. Today I'm going to show you a full guide on how to clean install windows, which can fix all your windows errors and crashes, improve your FPS in games, and much more. So let's get into the video. First, you have to back up all your files and apps to an external hard drive or USB drive that you have. What if you don't have any of these options? Then you have to make a backup partition. If you already have one, don't worry, simply move your files to that drive. If not, you need to download a tool called WinPartition. I'll make a short video about that later. Next, I'm going to show you how to find your Windows product key if you don't remember it. The first method is using command prompt. In the search box, type CMD, right click, and select run as administrator. Now you have to type this command, also I'll leave it in the description, so it's easy for you guys. Once you've typed the command, press enter to see the key. If you don't see any key, you're running a copy version of Windows. Next method is using registry editor. Search for registry editor and open it, now navigate to this location. Click a local machine. Software. Microsoft. Windows NT. current version, and finally software protection platform. Again, if you don't see your production key here, you haven't activated your windows. If you have it, note it somewhere, just in case. Now we need to download the Windows Media Creation Tool from browser. We are going to create a bootable USB with a media creation tool. Then we can boot it and fresh install windows. Click download now to download the tool. Once you've done it, plug the USB drive into your computer and open the media creation tool. To install Windows, you'll need an 8GB USB flash drive. Check the USB drive, if you have any data on it, delete it. Select create installation media, and then press the next button. And we have some options here, simply select your language and edition. If you're not sure about architecture, you can check it by going to this PC, right click and go to properties. You can see your current system type here. Nowadays, most PCs have 64 bit operating system. Tick this box and click on next. Now you have to select your USB and ensure that it has no data on it. Again, select your USB drive and click on next. This will take 10 to 20 minutes to download Windows to your USB flash drive. Click on finish and check your USB to see if it has downloaded. Now your USB drive name should have changed to SD USB. Next you'll need to know how to get to your BIOS for that search in your browser. How to BIOS and then type your model number. After entering your BIOS, locate the restore settings and select factory reset or default BIOS. Go to your settings, updates, and security, then recovery. Under the Advanced Startup click on Restart Now. Now click on Use a Device and select the correct USB drive you installed, Windows. Then select your language and other preferences and click Next. Click on Install Now. Accept the license term. And select Custom and double click it. If you have couple of drives, you only need to delete the C drive partitions. For me, it's Drive 1. So I'm going to delete the partitions on Drive 1 and deleted partitions will be moved to the unallocated space. Do not delete other drive partitions if you have anything on them. All of them will be erased and you can't get it back. For installation process will take some time. It really depends on how fast your computer is. When it's done, click restart now. During the restart process, make sure to remove your USB flash drive. These are personal things. Take your time and set up. After you've done it, it will take a few minutes of loading screens and some welcome messages before it will start your Windows. So that's how you can format and clean install Windows on your PC. Thank you for watching this video. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comment section. See you guys next time.